My name is Jacob Romeo Lequier, and uh, I was the art director and writer on Moon's Zaheen. I'm Stéphane Martinier. I was uh, invited to help out complete the program of Jacob and can offer my help uh, based on the program that Jacob put together. So it was kind of a pleasure to uh, meet Jacob and, and, and kind of help out and, and kind of share all that knowledge, you know, to help his students complete their program. And he was instrumental in helping them get the narrative to sync with the images. I think what was very interesting is, is to, to really get the students understanding, you know, how important the story is to the visual and not just think all the time like many, you know, beginners do about designing something because it's cool. Yeah. Without having really a story to it. Yeah. And tie it to a narrative that's very specific you know, kind of forces you to think very, very acutely about, okay, what is important? You know, how, how is that design making sense? For that, it was an experience, you know, like making an omelet. So mm -hmm. it was taking several eggs, putting them into a bowl, and once you do that and you pour it, you yeah. can't tell what the individual eggs are, but you just have this beautiful omelet in the end, and uh, I think that was a big learning curve for most of the students on this project. To me, it, it's like, what's interesting is how do you approach you know, each project, and you know, the book is a very good example on that. It's like, when you look at it for the, for the book itself, or the story itself, then it has a very different meaning and you approach it very differently than when you say, okay, what, what is it for me? You know, or it's about me. You know, so suddenly it's about something that's much bigger, like a film, you know, and then you learn to work, you know, with a team of friends, and you learn, you learn to appreciate what they do. You learn to let go of things when you have to let go of things. And, and, uh, and in that process, you know, the teamwork kind of emerges and, and that's, that's the, the best part of it. Once people started trusting each other and letting go of their individual identity in the project, yeah. it start, uh, good work started to emerge. One of the main things that you always look at of an artist is not the fact that he draws the best, it's the fact that he has good ideas. Yeah. If a guy is not that great at drawing, it's not a problem because you can always find someone to do it, to make things better. But someone with ideas, that's very difficult. And someone who understands how you process an idea and you develop a design based on that process is invaluable. And that's always what I've been looking at the most, you know, when yeah. I'm looking for, for students and artists.